So many hints, such little time. Welcome back to new quick hints video and this time there were so many more hints and theories about that episode that I really had some struggles deciding which ones I want to present to you. I hope that I picked out some interesting ones. I know some of you are more interested in the hidden hints and some of you are more interested in the actual molding actions during the tasks. I always try to have a look at all of that and pick out the most interesting ones. So I hope you are interested in the upcoming free ones as well. Before we get through that, I want to say a huge, huge thank you to all of you who are watching my videos, who are liking and writing comments, and especially to those of you who wrote comments on my last Hints and Theories video, simply because this is exactly why I started all of that here. It was so much fun reading your ideas, your hints, your theories, discussing about them, and I really, really hope that we can keep that going, because it was simply so much fun. And another little thing before we get to quick hint number one, I did a check up on that Kim Lian theory some people had because they believe that during task one Kim Lian turned a table. So as you know the candidates all had a table with the colored errors on them and if you would turn the table then of course you would walk in the wrong direction. And I did a check up on that, so I rewatched the scenes and tried to analyze from which side the sun shone on her, for example, and I couldn't figure out that she turned her table. But if you think she turned the table, then please let me know where exactly you can see that. And yeah, just help me figure the theory out. Now to quick hint number one, and that one has to do with Letizia and Thomas. So during task one, those two are the only ones to get on that little boat and then to get to Rick. And when they arrive at a tiny island, we can hear Letizia talking in an interview scene. And she tells us that she arrived there alone without her Medikandidata, so without the other candidates. And that confused me a little bit because, well, she is not alone there, Thomas is right next to her. And the only conclusion I could come up with is that she suspects Thomas to be the mole, so that he is her mole, which is why she does not count him as a candidate. Then I checked whether we get to know who she filled her test out on at the end of the episode, and no, we don't know that. And we also don't know who she filled her test out on in episode number four. Well, why would the production not tell us who she filled her test out on, but leave that weird sentence in the show? That is a bit weird to me, which is why I wanted to tell you about it. Also, we know that Zahir suspects Thomas a lot, so maybe we should not cross Thomas off of our lists too quickly. And as you know, I promised you a water-related hint, and it actually leads to Thomas as well, or let's say it could lead to Thomas, because during task one we see that little riddle with the birds in them, so two pelicans fly behind one duck, and it seemed so weird to me, because why would you pick pelicans? I mean, you could use that riddle with any other animal, or let's say with any other birds, why pelicans? And then in task two we had the swans, so all of those birds live close by or in the water, and I did some check up and I figured out that there are some pelicans living in Norvenia. I did not know that, so thanks for educating me via the mall. But also pelicans live in the Democratic Republic of Congo. And during task 2 we get to know one more time that Thomas was born in the Democratic Republic of Congo. Also, for all of you who are probably already in the Thomas Tunnel, I want to throw you in a little bit deeper. <laughs> because the name Thomas means twin. And we have several things double in that episode. I just want to remind you of the 11 and the 22. But Thomas actually wouldn't be the first mole called Thomas. Because in 2017 the name of the mole also was Thomas. And there were things happening doubled as well. So now all of you who are deeply in the Thomas Tunnel, you can thank me later. And now to quick hint number three, which has to do with Kim Lian. 
And of course, no hints of theories video without anything leading to Kim Leon. It's simply not possible. And this time it is about her saying that she hates biking in task number two. So she tells that Zahir, who is her, well, teammate in that game. And actually we know that she likes biking quite a lot. So for example, she has written several articles about how to explore Sweden by bike. There were so many things happening during that episode and I'm sure we can find still some more hints and theories. Something else interesting, for example, is why Zahil stole the mobile telephone and why we only get to see that in a very quick, quick, quick short shot. That's why I'm really curious if you have found anything else, any other hints and theories and what you think about the ones I just presented to you. Let me know about all of that. And I also want to give you a little preview to the next Hints and Theories video because last time I told you about a hint hidden in the show Molenstraten and this time there was another hint hidden as well and we will talk about that one in the next Hints and Theories video to episode number 6. Until then, I wish you so much fun with episode number 6 whenever you can watch it and have a nice weekend everyone. Bye!